What's up guys, welcome back to another episode of my Borderlands, the pre-sequel unique weapon guide, and today we're going to be looking at the Fridlia. Now the Fridlia is one of those guns that makes me happy. It's a good gun. It's one I recommend going and getting because it's really, really good. However, uh, it doesn't have a special skin. Oh, it has a blue rarity doll SMG skin. Why? Why? This reminds me of the Perlescens in Borderlands 2, how at first uh, a lot of them didn't have special skins, but they're really special guns. And this gun is no exception, but anyway, to get this gun, you want to head over to the veins of Helios and go talk to Laszlo. Now, the thing is, in order to get Laszlo, you need to do another, uh, another couple of quests before He's, he, like, spawns. You have to do... I'm pretty positive. Don't, do not quote me on this, but I am pretty positive, like, 92% positive, that you get the starting mission for this quest line in Jack's office, and you get it from Tacitor, the bounty board, but Tacitor issues it to you, and I think it's called boarding parties, I think, you're, you're fighting the infection, or like, not really fighting it, but going and checking out this infection that made all the rats and whatever, blah, 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 that's basically what that quest line is about, and once you complete it, it leads you to Laszlo, who is, uh, one of the infected dudes, and he has a freeze, a freeze easy, and then you grab a freeze easy. Basically, for this mission, you use the freeze easy to uh, freeze his buddies, and they break into meat chunks, and then you give them to him, and he's like, um, um, oops, oops, I will honor them so hard, but apparently he's just gonna eat them or something. I don't even know. I don't even know. It's a weird quest. It's a weird character. Uh, I like it, but oh well. Also, in order to get the freeze easy, uh, you have to kill Laszlo after the second mission, the mission after this one. And, uh, he has a chance to drop it, but he doesn't respawn, so I have to get another character to do that guide for you. But anyway, but anyway, um, once you complete that, like, weird mission, you get the Fridlia, which is awesome. This thing, look at that recoil reduction, 127%. You do not feel the recoil on this thing at all. This gun is, has, like, no recoil. It's so stable. It's a really, really good gun. Like, it has a really high burst fire count. And it's really good. It also has like the double, uh, like a double projectile multiplier. And it, it sort of reminds me of like uh, the Lasco or the Lascox, however, however you said it. it uh, it's probably Lasco, but that's up for debate. Uh, it, from Borderlands 2, except this one is elemental, of course. Now it'll always, always be cryo. I mean, that's that's just a that's just a thing. You look at the red text in a you know icy moon of Mungo, and uh, that red text is a uh, ref. Prince, apparently, to a comic strip from Flash Gordon, which uh, takes place in the planet Mungo, in which an ice kingdom called Fridlia, or Fridlia? Yeah, I think it's pronounced the same way. It's without the D, basically, is located. I don't know. I uh, was never a Flash Gordon fan. Uh, that's kind of, that's a little bit too old for my taste. But anyway, this gun is great. Basically, it is like a buffed up, like, Las Lasco in my opinion, because it has that cryo, and its elemental effect chance is crazy high, you will like always like freeze enemies like all the time, like it's like the two scoops, it's really really good, um, but that's the only thing you can really compare this gun and the two scoops with, because uh, the two scoops is a bad gun, it's utility only, this gun is damage and utility, if you're rocking a melee Athena and you're using like the two scoops to freeze your enemies, I recommend ditching that, getting this, using this to freeze your enemies, and then you have a good gun to get yourself out of fight for your life with. Now, as you can see right now, I'm having a hard time getting out of fight for my life, because he was hiding behind a thing, and, uh, yeah, and the bullet spread for this is kind of, you know, it, it, it's kind of large, it's kind of large, but, oh well, oh well, it's still a really good gun, like, honestly, if you're running a melee Athena, and you're using the whole two scopes, two scopes, two scopes, 360 two scopes, the whole two scope thing where you freeze your enemies and then hit them, uh, hit them with a big melee crit, I just recommend, you know, tossing that gun out, going and getting this one, because it's all around better, and, you know, it's, it's a lot better, it's a lot better, and if, even if you're a gun-based guy, especially, especially if you're a gun-based guy, use this gun, this gun is a beast, like, holy crap, this is probably my favorite SMG in the game so far, that uh, is new at least, that is new. It sort of is like the last code, but it's just buffed up. It's like what they did to the Hornet. It's like when they made the Hornet into the Blowfly. It's just better. It's just good. And that's saying something, because the last code was a beast. Now, of course, Cryo does resist shields, but it doesn't really matter, because you kind of melt through shields. Well, not really melt. You freeze through them. 
you freeze through them pretty quickly. And there's a celebration barrel. Say hi to the celebration barrel. Well, you can't really say hi. It's sort of dead. There's another one coming up if you want to say hi to that one before I kill it. But, yeah, this is a great gun, guys. This really is a great gun. And I do highly recommend it. I do highly recommend it. Not like Rosie recommend it, but like really close. Like, remember when I recommended the Rosie? Yeah. It's close to that. It's close. Not quite there because the Rosie is like unrivaled in every form of way. But it is very very much recommended you guys go out and pick this gun up it's really really good even if you're running through like normal mode pick it up pick it up if you're go if you're in true vault mode wait till level 50 this is like a gun you want to use level 50 this gun is great i'd love to see nisha use this gun i gotta try it out on nisha because nisha makes everything that's awesome even better so can't wait to try that one out but anyway i'm kind of just rambling on to the into like the the gameplay footage here ends and i die because spoilers spoiler alert flaredly dies flaredly dies at the end of this video <gasps> oh no oh no yeah i don't know i don't know i i die my bullets weren't hitting or something i don't even know what happened we're about to see but anyway guys um, i'm on fire see me tom cruise and that's pretty much it i want to thank y'all for watching i very much appreciate it and i'm gonna go ahead and see you guys later bye